Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So it's been a while since I've done a uh, sit down video and a haul and review and stuff like that. And I've noticed that that's what does the best on my channel. And it's honestly what I have the most fun doing. I like doing the vlogs, but I really like going into reviews and stuff because this is my favorite kind of stuff to watch on YouTube. Yeah, let's just uh, go ahead and get into everything. If you want to see all that, then just keep on it watching. Is the Vera Bradley bag. I'm just going to show you it real quick and then I'll hop right back to it. Uh, like I said, at this timestamp. So if you came just for that, you can come uh, back to this and see that. So here's the Vera Bradley bag. Then I went to Hot Topic today to try to find a little pouch to go inside of it to just hold my smaller items because it's kind of a smaller bag. And um, yeah, we went in Hot Topic and they were doing their clearance section. Buy one and you get two for free. So I was like, well, let's just go see if they might have a bag. And did they have one? They had this little three pouch set that is Disney. It's Mickey Mouse makeup bag set. This is normally $30. So I bought this one and I got my next two items for free. So I'll go ahead and show you guys what this looks like. The three pouches. And you can see the background of this a little bit better. There you go. So it's Mickey and Minnie like leaning in to smooch. <laughs> but yeah, that'll be a cute makeup bag. And then this is the one little pouch. It doesn't really go with like the colors I was going for. So I don't know what. I'll probably just end up using these for makeup or traveling. And then I really love this pouch that it came with. And I'll put the little wristlet strap on it. It came with the other one and I just attached it to this one. But it gives me like very like Chanel-esque vibes mixed with uh, Mickey Mouse. So yeah, I thought this was super cute. And I've already got my items in here for my bag. So it's good to go. But yeah, it actually holds a lot. Like I've got medicines, a hairbrush, like one of those foldable travel brushes, uh, business cards, band-aids. Uh, little clickers and some of my cables and everything. Yeah, holds all of that in here. So perfect little travel coin pouch. So I got this onward um, like badge holder to put my work badge on. And I actually thought that movie was super cute. You guys have to let me know what you thought of that movie, but I thought it was awesome because it's like wizards and um, they're nerdy and it's got like a modern twist to it. So I thought it was like super cool. So I really like that one. And um yeah, it's got a place you can... And then um, got has the little truck, or the big truck that the brother drives around. And then here is the characters on the strap. Let's see if you can see it a little better. Let me get out of the light there. You can see the print of... Oh, I've got him upside down. There we go. Now you can see him a little bit better. I love the colors of this, though. Like, I really like this, like, blue color. I think it's super pretty. One of the best. <laughs> I found a Deathly Hollows scarf. It has the symbol there and it is like a thick scarf. Like this is gonna be the perfect winter scarf. And uh, we're pretty much out of winter. We're already into spring now. So I'll have this for next year, but it has the print Deathly Hollows right here going down it. Let's see, you turn it where you can see it better. There we go. Deathly Hollows. And then it has the two symbols right here at the bottom. Has it on both sides. So it has the print double-sided. And it has the um, the symbols double-sided on here as well. With like this really nice fringe at the bottom. And it looks so nice on. And it's so warm. Super warm and cozy. And I love gray. Like I absolutely love gray. And it has like the gray, black, and white. It looks so cool. So this is what it looks like once you loop it, loop it up a little bit. Yeah, look how freaking nice that looks. Isn't that so freaking cute? So oh, yeah, 20 bucks and I got those three sets. And I think it is an awesome deal. So, and I looked online for you guys to try to see if Hot Topic was doing the sale online. They are not. They have uh, clearance items and then they have items, I think most of the sites marked down like 20% off, but they do not have the buy one, get two free. So if you have a local hot topic to get to it if you want to go find you some uh, some good clearance. Now food. here's the part of the video where we're gonna get into the Vera Bradley bag. I want to show you guys this in detail 
so that you can have a good idea if this is something that you want to get. This originally, when I was first looking for this, was gone. They're only doing it for a limited time. I don't know how long of a limited time. I think I think these launched last year sometime. So if you order these off the website, you do have to pay full price for shipping and then full price for the item. There's no coupons or discounts or anything. But um, I think they're actually worth it. Like these are really, really freaking nice. This is probably one of the nicest ones I've seen Vera Bradley put out. And obviously I'm gonna be somewhat biased because I love Harry Potter. So yeah, let's go ahead and show you guys. I have, there's a, a key ring here at the top or a D ring or whatever they call these. And I have a uh, Minnie Mouse hand sanitizer and some pepper spray that I'm just hanging from it. And then it has the one strap. And what I do, I carry every, if every single bag that I have, crossbody, shoulder bag, those little wrist arm bags, whatever it is, it doesn't matter. I will find a way to put a strap on it or rig the strap somehow to where I'm just carrying it like this. Literally over my shoulder. I carry every bag I have over my shoulder. And this one works perfect for that, honestly, because I can throw it like this and where it has this padding, it's so, it feels like there's nothing in here. Literally nothing. Like it's super light and very padded and comfortable to wear. And here's the thing too, is that when you wear this shoulder, you can actually like spin this down and then all of your zippers are facing up. So you can literally like just get in here, get your wallet, um, get everything you need to get out of it. I'll show you guys multiple ways that you can wear this. It has an extender, so you can wear it like crossbody, like this, obviously with the extender it would be better, but crossbody like this, and then it sits on your back like that. And then if you want to, you can wear it across the front of you. I don't like personally wearing it like any of these ways. Honestly, I like wearing it over my shoulder, but you can wear it in front of you like this. And you can, like I said, you can have the extender to where it'll come down uh, like more at your hip if you want that. That'd probably be a good style if you're going to the parks. So you're more hands free. You don't have to worry about it like falling over when you have it on your shoulder. And then you can also wear it as a uh, fanny pack. I don't like wearing it as a fanny pack because I pack it to the brim and it sticks off my body really far. So I kind of don't like that. And I think that's about every way that you can wear it. So crossbody, shoulder bag, fanny pack. I mean, this thing is so easily convertible and it's just a really good size. Like it's not too big and not too small. It's pretty much perfect. So yeah, that's the different ways that you can wear it. Has this padded strap here in the back that has a buckle that unclicks so that you can add the extender onto it. And then it has just a regular plain strap right here at the bottom. So this is what it looks like. This print is so freaking pretty. As soon as I seen this, I knew I had to have it. I was like, this has to be mine <laughs> because the print is absolutely gorgeous. It has Harry Potter right here on the straps with some striping. And I love this blue color. Like it's such a pretty like dark navy blue. It has Hedwig, Harry's glasses, got the time turner, the key, the snitch, the um, remember all <laughs> brooms, the uh, Harry's wand. Yeah, it has the Nimbus right here. Snitch, some lightning bolts. It has all kinds of uh, the Hogwarts crest. My favorite is the chocolate frog and I don't think it's on this back. It's like cut off here at the top. Chocolate frog right there. I think it's also on It's on the strap a little bit. You can see it right there. Chocolate frog. Chocolate frog is my favorite. So I was kind of hoping it was going to come with it. But the only solid one I've seen on here is the one that's on the bottom of the bag. So it's got chocolate frog there. So that's another thing too. When you order these online, you don't know how the print is going to turn out. I want to show you guys something funny when this came in. I thought this was hilarious. It literally, this little piece of fabric right here has Hedwig like upside down. <laughs> that was kind of funny and sort of random. Out of all of the like scrap pieces to put in this little corner section. I love all of it. I think it's wicked. I think that how they've made it subtly Harry Potter is so freaking cool. And um, yeah, all the other like Damask type print that they put on this looks wicked. So very cool. All right, now let me show you zippers. So the front pocket is about as big as my, not my whole hand, but most of my hand. This is a good size like pouch in the front. Right now I have my stylus for my iPad. I have a pen, have a Baby Lips Dr. Rescue chapstick, 
some tweezers, nail clippers, and a little mirror. So that's everything in this front pocket. In the side pocket, this is the main compartment right here, <laughs> about to fall out already, is a uh, Victoria's Secret bombshell rollerball. Have, oh, and here's the print on the inside. Let me take all this out and then I'll show you guys what the print on the inside looks like. I have the Mickey Mouse pouch that I showed you guys earlier. And then, like I said, this thing can hold quite a bit as well. And it fits... It fits right down in here just to show you guys what that looks like. I'll just take stuff out and show you. So yeah, the pouch fits right down in there. I can actually fit my my whole, um, I have the mini iPad and it fits in here. It completely fits. So just to give you another idea of the sizing. Um, I have a taser. This is uh, Bath and Body Works Perfect Peony Lotion. And what else is in here? Oh, this is the extra strap if you need to make it more uh, extended out. And this is a receipt section, and I'll show you guys this print on the inside. Hopefully you can see that pretty good. Yeah, has the, you can see it has the tag right here. It says Harry Potter and Vera Bradley. And then it has the sorting hat, flying key, his glasses, and the, um, the crest right there. Hogwarts crest. And yeah, it's in like a dark navy blue, so it's kind of kind of completely opposite from what the outside is but very different very good i like it a lot the entire thing and then on the zippers too it has harry potter on one side and then it has veer bradley here on the other side okay and then the last pocket right here is the one that's closest to your body and i think this one's perfect for your wallet and like i said i put my cell phone here so that's like your two main things that you need to keep <laughs> Especially if you're using this as like a park bag, if you go to the parks. Um, I like keeping that stuff close to my body. And another thing that's really nice is that the back section right here has a, like a thick layer of padding. Like a super thick layer of padding. So you don't feel anything really that sticks in this pocket. Because my wallet is pretty sharp and I don't feel it at all. So I'll go ahead and show you guys. What I do is clip my wallet to my zipper so I can just get right to it. And this is my wallet. I think I've shown you guys this one before. This is my little miniature Victoria's Secret card case. And I have it packed to the absolute gills. This thing is like stretched out. I have so many cards in here. But yeah, I just keep it zipped or attached to the zipper. So that if anybody did reach in to get it, they ain't going anywhere with it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I just keep that in there. And then I keep the uh, little paperwork from where I bought this and I also have another receipt in here wow I got a lot of receipts in this bag and the back pocket actually the print in here is not the same as the main print in the rest of the bag it has the Vera Bradley little uh like triangle crest type logo on the inside and it's super sm uh, smooth it has more of like a satin kind of finish like a silky satin kind of finish right there. And then like I said, the Harry Potter one on the, this side is more of like a cotton, like a regular cotton feel. Absolutely freaking love this. I think it is so pretty. Um, yeah. And a really good size, like compared to your, you know, to my body and everything. Like this is a really decent size. Like as far as my hand goes to show you. And I think the dimensions on this is it's 13 and a half tall and i think it is seven and a half wide and maybe like an inch or two inches right here but like i said it fits everything that i carry so yeah i absolutely love this highly recommend it if you guys can get your hands on. so yeah that has been my haul and my review of this bag i uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video like i said i'm gonna try to put more stuff out there like this and this will be my new uh background I love that you guys have to tell me what you think of it. I love Disney and Harry Potter, so I put all of my stuff out here on display at my desk. And I got my new painting up. I painted this uh, this past week. And yeah, I'm, I'm really loving this this new setup and new idea and ways I'm, I'm going to be doing this. So I hope you guys do too. And uh, yeah, thank y'all so much for watching. And we'll see y'all in the next one. Bye, guys.